Hey what's up guys, in today's video I will try to show and explain to you what HDR is, so let's get started. Probably everyone has heard for HDR, it's quite popular these days. We can find that option on our phones when we launch our camera app. But what is HDR? HDR stands for High Dynamic Range. So dynamic range is difference between the brightest spot on picture and the darkest one. Higher it is, more cinematic does your video look like. So that is why we shoot in flat picture profiles to get that dynamic range. But many of you haven't seen HDR video yet, neither did I until recently. I went to store and tried to find HDR TV so I could see the difference. But then I realized, wait, I have a phone that supports HDR. As most of you do, but finding an app that could support HDR content was even harder than finding HDR content. But just recently YouTube has added option for HDR videos, so I found one from Austin Evans where he shot his iPhone X video in HDR. So for all of you who don't own an HDR TV or phone, I will try to replicate how does it look. And you are probably asking yourself what kind of magic will I use to do that. Don't worry. I will play some video on standard dynamic range device or SDR device like iPhone and on HDR supported device like my Sony XZ Premium which also has a 4K display. So while watching this try to see that difference between the brightest spot and the darkest spot on the screen. It may look like Sony has AMOLED display but it doesn't, it has the same old LCD display just like iPhone. But you can clearly see how images are more contrasty and saturated on XE Premium. It's because it supports HDR10, so it's HDR ready. And things get even worse when you compare HDR screen to old screen like this MacBook Air. Take notice that iPhone has the best LCD on the market even if it's not HDR ready. So there we go guys, I hope I have demonstrated the difference between HDR and SDR screen. Like always, thank you for watching and see you in the next one.